think Santa's gonna come and join us in this song. Hey. Hey Glam Fam, I'm Maddie and welcome to the channel. Here on this platform I share lots of beauty tips, hacks, and tricks. I also share lifestyle and other different types of videos. So if you're interested in anything that I just mentioned, make sure that you hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications. So you guys, this item that I'm about to mention in this video, I've been taking literally every day. And I've seen such a fantastic changes with my body. So I just had to share these with you guys. And these are CMOS vitamins. Okay, now as you all know, CMOS is a huge phenomenon on the internet and all over the world right now. And let me tell you all, it is within good reason, okay? There are so many different types of benefits to CMOS and I'm going to be sharing a ton of them with you guys in today's video. So you might want to grab your popcorn, sit back, and go ahead and enjoy the show because girl, you are going to enjoy it. Now CMOS is a spiny sea vegetable vegetable that is harvested primarily for its health benefits and different types of benefits that it offers. If you've heard about sea moss supplements, you may wonder how you can consume them and different things that you can use them for, which don't worry girl, I got you covered. What is sea moss? This is something that everyone might be wondering whenever you see this plastered all over social media. And don't worry, I was no different. I heard everybody talking about it, I heard different family and friends coming to me like girl you should use sea moss and I was like what what is sea moss please explain and nobody could ever properly explain it so I only started learning things when my mom taught me about it and also when I started learning different things about sea moss myself sea moss grows in the waters among the Atlantic coast primarily between North America and Europe. It is an edible plant similar to things like seaweeds. Now sea moss grows in a number of different colors such as shades of green, yellow, red, purple, black, a lot of different shades you guys. The most common varieties that grow in the water are generally red and called Irish moss. Red seaweeds like sea moss contain a ton of different nutrients that you do not want to miss out on. They're naturally low in calories of fat and sugar. And they contain a small amount of plant protein. 20 grams of sea moss typically contains about 10 to 20 calories. And in protein, it typically has 0.5 grams. Like other sea vegetables, sea moss is typically a good source of iodine, a micronutrient necessary for thyroid health. Now let's talk about some of the different uses of sea moss because I already know y'all want to know. Today, sea moss is mostly used as vitamins in order to benefit the health and for the many other nutrients that sea moss offers. And you can most commonly find it in supplement form, which is what I'm currently using with this, which will be listed down below for those of you guys that are interested. Don't hesitate to check out the description box as well as for the eyes in the card above because you guys are not going to want to miss out on all of the benefits of sea moss. Now sea moss can support thyroid health. Seaweeds are rich in iodine and this is a particular supplement that is great for thyroid health. So if you are someone who struggles with thyroids you're going to absolutely love sea moss for your body. But that is not all. Sea moss can also support immunity, which is something that is great for us during this time. There are so many different sicknesses floating around and taking something like sea moss can prevent your chances of catching them even more. Which you guys, I am so happy that I started taking sea moss because your girl is typically around a lot of people, especially due to me being an entertainer along with my mom. We are around a lot of people, we meet a lot of people, and of course you 
want to stay as healthy as you possibly can and sea moss is one of the ways in order to take that extra precaution. Now sea moss is also able to improve gut health. Seaweeds are a great source of good bacteria and fiber which both support a healthy gut which you definitely want to have you guys. Now if you are someone who is looking to lose weight, sea moss will also be beneficial for that. Y'all know that your girl ain't never tried to lose a pound in her life, but if you are interested in that and you have a healthy diet along with sea moss, you definitely will achieve those results that you are looking for. Sea moss is a great way in order to get that metabolism going and get all of those extra pounds off that you do not want, honey. And a few other things that it helps with is heart health, fertility, and also blood sugar management. Now we can't talk about the good without talking about the bad. So come on now, come on in the room, let's talk about the bad. <laughs> Now one of the main potential downsides to sea moss is that not much research has been conducted on the benefits of sea moss and not much research has also been done on its nutritional makeup. As with seaweed, the nutritional value can definitely vary all depending on what type of seaweed or sea moss you're using. Now while it is a good source of iodine, you can also over consume iodine by taking sea moss. So definitely be paying attention to how much sea moss you're consuming and how much you can take within your body. If your body ever gets to the point where it's saying, uh-uh, honey, I can't take no more of this, then definitely make sure that you tone down on the sea moss because sea moss has a lot of great benefits, but as we all know, there's pretty much a downside to everything. Sea moss is amazing, as you guys have probably learned from this video. But like with all things, overconsumption can cause a lot of issues. So pay attention to your body, pay attention to how much you're consuming. I feel like these capsules are great for a lot of us because you are not over consuming. Whereas if you buy something in a form as to where you have to make it yourself and or you have to do something with it yourself, it can get to the point where you are over consuming it. So I typically take one of these each and every single night and I'm gonna share with you guys how big they are just so that you guys can know. If you're someone that isn't really into pills, this may not be the best thing for you because, honey, these are pretty big. And you guys, the sad part is I really tried my hardest not to drop this, but I still did. So you guys can see it's a pretty big pill. So if you're someone that can't really take pills, um, you may not like these. But they are very, very good. Um, you can always open... Okay now Alexa girl, that's kind of rude. But you can always open these up and end up putting this in water or whatever you may be consuming in order to get some of the best benefits from it if you are someone that cannot really take pills. With that being said, there are a ton of different benefits to sea moss and you guys just learned a few of them with me on today. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to give it a huge <laughs> thumbs up. If you take sea moss, let me know down below because I'd love to know a little bit more about it you and that is it for this video i want to thank you guys so much for watching